Welcome to our YouTube channel. Today we will show you full process of how to manufacturing sugar from sugar cane. Sugar cane from the field which is weighted on weight bridge is unloaded into the feeder table. It is dropped into cane carrier and cane carrier carries the sugar cane for further preparation. Firstly, cane is cutting with the help of cane kicker and then cane move on for leveling. Next, cane leveler is leveling all the passed cane and fibers are removed with the help of cane fibrizer. Prepared cane passes through the four consecutive mill, which mill consists of three cylindric roll and all the five mills are driven by powerful 500 DC motors. As you can see, this is juice extracting process. Extracted juice from the first mill and second mill is collected together in one place and dropped into the bottom tank, which will uplift to the store tank later. Hot water is added at the discharge of 4th mill for extracting maximum sugar juice from the bugs. Final discharge of bugs from 5th mill is carried to boiler through rack elevator. Then bugs is stored to the backyard of mill and used in boiler to steam generate and excess bugs will use later during mill stoppage. Feeders of boiler feeds bugs into the furnace. Steam generated from the boiler is sent to set of turbine and generated power is distributed to the mills through distribution panel. Surplus power were exported. Extracted juice mixed with water is sent to boiling house and juice is heated in juice heater at 70 degrees celsius in order to bleach and maintain ph of the juice it is treated with the milk of lime and sulfur dioxide the treated juice is the further heated at 105 degrees celsius then the juice goes into the clear fire tank it takes over 2 hours to settle impurity fall to the bottom of the tank. The settled mud is pumped to rotary vacuum filter where the mud is filtered from the juice and filter juice is returned to process further while the fresh mud cake remains outside. The clarified juice collect from the clarified tank is now boiled in serial of 5 liters. This brings the concentrations of sugar up 
from 15% to 60%. The juice is evaporated to syrup stage. The syrup is treated with the sulfur dioxide gas. The sulfated syrup is pumped out to vacuum pan for further concentration and formation of sugar cane. Microscopic sucrose crystals mean slurry is poured onto the syrup to develop crystal inside and formation of sugar crystals inside the vacuum pan. Workers are regularly checked how to sugar is crystallizing. When the crystal reach is desired size, it will drop down to the centrifugal machine. The machine is operates between 50 to 1100 rpm which draws the molars to outer shell. Hot water is spread inside the basket to wash crystal and separate molars from the basket. It takes to the pan section for reprocess. Sugar crystals inside the basket is dropped at hooper and then goes to the dryer. Hot air is blown into the dryer to remove moisture content from the sugar crystal. Dry sugar from the dryer is taken to grated by the bucket conveyor and powder sugar grated down. Sugar with the standard size are carried to sugar storage bin. Finally, the sugar is bagged in bags of 50 kg. Bagged sugar are carried by belt conveyors and stocked in godown and delivered to customers.
होप यू लाइक द वीडियो प्लीज डोंट फॉरगेट टू लाइक शेयर एंड कमेंट्स